Hello there, Mark Sabatella from Mastering MuseScore here. In this tip, I'm going to show you the swap with clipboard command in MuseScore and how we can use it to actually exchange two pieces of music. And what I mean is, say you have a passage one spot in the song, another passage somewhere later on, and you want them reversed. You want them to trade places. Or, as I'm going to show, maybe you've got at the same spot in the score two different instruments playing two different parts, and you want them to swap. That's what I'm going to show how to do here. So I've got a score here with a bass clarinet part and a bassoon part, and I'm deciding that maybe for these three measures here, I want the bassoon to be playing what the bass clarinet is currently playing and vice versa. So the way I'm going to do this is I've selected the bass clarinet part for those three measures, and then I'll use Control C to copy that to my clipboard. Now I can select the same or the corresponding three measures in the bassoon part. And now what I want to do is I want to get the bass clarinet part to replace what's there in the bassoon, but I want the bassoon part to simultaneously get into my clipboard so I can paste it back to the bass clarinet. So the command that does that, it's here in the edit command, in the edit menu, and you'll see swap with clipboard. And there's a keyboard shortcut defined for it, control shift X or command shift X on a Mac. So if I use this command, it's going to first paste that bass clarinet part into the bassoon part, but it also pulled the bassoon part into the clipboard. So now if I return to the bass clarinet part and paste, now it has what the bassoon used to have. So that allowed me to swap the two parts. It's a really useful uh, technique to know about. It's the swap with clipboard command.